Oral glucose tolerance test. Oral glucose tolerance test, a test to determine the body's ability to handle glucose. In the test, a person fasts overnight at least 8 but not more than 16 hours. Then first, the fasting plasma glucose is tested. After this test, the person receives 75 grams of glucose 100 grams for pregnant women. Usually, the glucose is in a sweet tasting liquid that the person drinks. Blood samples are taken up to four times to measure the blood glucose. For the test to give reliable results, the person must be in good health not have any other illnesses, not even a cold. Also, the person should be normally active not lying down, for example, as an inpatient in a hospital and the person should not be taking medicines that could affect the blood glucose. For three days before the test, the person should have eaten a diet high in carbohydrates 150-200 grams per day. The morning of the test, the person should not smoke or drink coffee. The oral glucose tolerance test measures blood glucose levels five times over a period of three hours. In a person without diabetes, the glucose levels rise and then fall quickly. In someone with diabetes, glucose levels rise higher than normal and fail to come back down as fast. People with glucose levels between normal and diabetic have what is termed impaired glucose tolerance IGT. People with IGT do not have diabetes. Each year, only 1-5% of people whose test results show IGT actually develop diabetes. And with retesting, as many as half of the people with IGT have normal oral glucose tolerance test results. Weight loss and exercise may help people with IGT return their glucose levels to normal. O R A L G L U C O S E T O L E R A N C. E. T. E. S. T. Oral Glucose Tolerance Test.